Hi everybody and welcome to 3D Survey Tutorials. In this video I'll be showing you how to use the draw lines tool found under CAD functions. This tool is used for categorizing different things like roads, construction sites, buildings, etc. It is done by using lines so it makes it easier to classify them. It's also used for measuring the size of an area which can also be later seen on the orthophoto if desired. To use it we must first click CAD in the upper right selection menu. Next, we click the Draw Lines tool icon which is placed fifth on the right menu. To use the tool, we must first decide where we want the endpoints of our line to be snapped on. We have a couple of options, all located in the snapper settings on the right. Normally, we use point, endpoint and triangle. The point snaps the endpoint of the line onto any point in the point cloud. Also, don't forget to turn on your point cloud. Endpoint snaps the endpoint to any endpoint of an already existing line. And triangle snaps the endpoint to any point on the 3D mesh. Don't forget to turn on your 3D mesh though. To see how the other snapping options work, watch the snapper settings tutorial that I will link in description. In the tool settings below, we can choose which measurements we want to have written on our line while we are drawing it. I will choose 2D distance. We add them by checking the box next to them. We can also add points on our endpoints by selecting the point on vertex option. We also have a more detailed tutorial for this option. I will put the link to it in description. Now let's get to drawing. First I choose the desired place on my 3D mesh and use the left mouse button to place an endpoint of my line. I will draw a couple of lines. If you have drawn a line incorrectly, you can always click the backspace, which will delete the last line that you drew. When you are happy with the lines you drew, you click the escape button on the keyboard or right mouse button to confirm your decision. If you want to delete the line you have made, just select it with the edit or selection tool and click the delete button on your keyboard. If you have drawn multiple lines at once, but let's say one turns out to be wrong and you have already confirmed your decision, you can also use the edit tool, but you must delete the second endpoint of the line you want to delete. In addition, if you are drawing the line and the point cloud has a minimum noise, let's say 5 cm, you don't want to snap on the wrong specific point. In this case, we can help you with the interpolate option to calculate an average height of the points which are in the blue circle. The points will snap in the center of the cross but on the average height of the points in the circle. This is all for this tutorial. Thank you and see you next time.